The 20th of August 2021. Mike Quincy. The future beckons and is full of promise and of an upliftment of your vibrations, and it is unstoppable as you start to enter a new area of space. In fact, it is beginning to affect those of you who are already living your life with ascension in mind. There are also signs that governments are losing their appetite for warlike actions, and you will find a growing reluctance to war with other nations. It was expected and welcomed as a precursor to world peace. Countries are seeking a more friendly approach to their actions where differences are causing strife and problems that in the past would have resulted in a cold war. It is particularly apparent where religious differences have previously been so powerful that peaceful solutions have been difficult to come by. Permanent peace between nations is coming and peaceful souls who know how to bring it about are appearing on the horizon. Ever since you passed the marker of 2012, the changes in vibrations have increased for the better, enabling the light to become stronger thus gradually subduing the lower vibrations. In fact, they have brought the higher vibrations into many aspects of life and souls who are ready in the human race have responded positively. It means that a peaceful existence is now more possible than any previous time in this solar cycle. Nothing can prevent the upliftment from continuing and it will take you all the way to ascension providing you are ready. You will find a peace of no equal that will bring true and lasting happiness. You may possibly try to understand how violence and destruction can continue in some countries together with great losses of life, but understand that such happenings are karmic, and often the souls on both sides are acting out their beliefs that can be almost identical. They would not be involved unless they needed the experiences to evolve, so each soul has opportunities to progress. Those who monitor such progress can help influence those involved and although on one level there appear to be winners and losers, every soul has the opportunity to evolve through their experiences. However, do not concern yourselves with the fate of other souls, each one has a life plan and with help will have the needed experiences to make progress. We know that you feel committed where your own family is concerned but be assured that their lives will give them the opportunities needed to carry on evolving. You would be surprised if you knew how much help is given as no souls are left to make their way alone. Clearly some are so unbelieving of the truth it is very difficult to influence their actions for their betterment. Yet the guides stand by ever waiting for those signs that a soul is beginning to awaken to the truth, and at the first signs a soul will respond to the light and so begin that long path leading to fulfillment and eventually ascension. Some of you will ask how you will know if you are doing sufficient to ensure that you will reach your goal. The answer is that providing you are where possible helping others to progress you are almost certain to be on the right path. At the same time you will be ensuring that you also give sufficient attention to your own needs, so you will most likely find yourself fully occupied with matters of the light. Generally you will almost certainly know intuitively where you are on the path of light. By focusing on all that is positive and working in service to others, you can hardly fail to recognize how much you have succeeded. At some stage all souls will have the opportunity to advance but with free will choice some may reject such an opportunity. However, they will continue to be helped and when they are ready to move on their guides will know and act accordingly. There is no penalty for lagging behind and it is accepted that souls must be allowed to progress at their own pace. The path that is set for you is carefully arranged so that you are, from time to time, led on to one that offers you a chance to increase your understanding of the purpose of life. There is of course a review of each life once it has finished, so as to determine what is needed the next time you incarnate to continue your evolution. Nothing of importance happens by chance, as your life plan is carefully arranged to ensure that you gain experience from the events that are arranged for you. As we have often informed you, every opportunity to move on is presented to you but left to you to decide whether to accept it. However, if you reject an important opportunity to move on it will come up again until you do. Be assured that what seem to be random happenings are all part of the plan to ensure you get the experiences you need to advance along your life path. Once learned they do not usually come up again. You will normally find that even those people around you and particularly family have been selected because they can influence you in matters that are important to you. 
This is particularly necessary during your growing years as it is molding your character, so that it will serve you well in the future and give you the experiences you need. Yes, family are extremely important for most of your life and can influence you in one way or another, but it will be your choice in the end. When you can accept that much happens in your life that is intended to help you evolve, it is hoped you give more thought to the meaning of life and learn the lessons that are intended to ensure you continue to progress. Think of life as an exam and if you pass it you move on to another level for even greater opportunities. It never stops until you reach the ultimate goal to return to the Godhead. Moving on from the present level into the fifth dimension is quite a jump and as a result life becomes a beautiful experience that is well worth aiming for. The dark ones cannot survive in such a high level as their vibrations are too low, and if they tried they would find it very uncomfortable. So what an opportunity is presenting itself to those who can lift themselves up into it. I leave you with love and blessings, and may the light brighten your days and path to completion. This message comes through my higher self, my God self, and every soul has the same connection to God. In love and light. Mike Quincy.